moving on now to our next race. These are the big boys, the Aprilia Thousands. So let's have a look at the standards after 11 rounds. Marsha Nell still leads it from Daniel Tarrant. John Roach in third, Darren Jones down to fourth, Steve Booker in fifth, and Stuart McClure down there in sixth place. So here we go, lights are going to change. Sound of thunder, we should call these boys. We have, uh, we have enjoyed this racing right from the first round of the series. And the class will be back next year, hopefully a little bit bigger. I probably have brought out a new machine, so we might actually see that racing. So let's have a look. Who's got the all-important first corner? Looks like number three, Daniel Tarrant. It is. He's got a clear view up the track. Then it's Marshall Neal behind him. Then it's John Rose. So Tarrant and Rose and Marshall Neal top three. So basically that's your top three in the championship at the moment. Now John Rose will want to finish in front of Daniel Tarrant. There's just a few points that separate them. Marshall Neal has basically got this one in the bag. 195 points. He really doesn't have to uh, risk anything here today, although he has been the prolific winner throughout the series. So the young Irishman enjoying this uh, class, also riding extremely well in the power bike class to boot. And uh, fourth at the moment, well, he was fourth, but he's now, I think, elevated himself up to third in the standings. So a bit of a dual rider. Join himself, Suzuki Tausdi races in the power bike. This is, the, of course, the Aprilia 1000, the uh, RSV Mealy. And uh, most of these bikes are all... Oh, and he's gone! Marshall Neal, well, he pushed it one nut too many. Let's have a look at it again. You see he just loses it completely in the wet weather. He's up on his feet and he's OK. Remember, he's got a broken angle, so that wouldn't have done him too good. But he's OK, that's the main thing. So out front, it's still number three, Daniel Tarrant. And at number six, John Rhodes. So these two, as I said, second and third in the standards coming here today. They're scrapping really over second place. Marshall Neal, um, well, he's lost any possibility of scoring points. Whoever wins this is going to get 25. I really don't think that's going to make any difference. That's not, even if one of these two wins at Brown's Hatch and Marshall Neal doesn't finish, Marshall's going to take the championship. So he, he, he is the champion. He's been a champion and regains his championship for this year as well so really it's all about second place these are the two that are scrapping over it one two two for john rose and one three seven for daniel tarrant and it's now john rose that leads tarrant is down the second place there's the checkered flag that's how it's going to finish so john rose helps to narrow the gap between himself and daniel tarrant but it isn't going to be enough i don't think so Rosie leads it from Daniel Tarrant second, from Darren Jones in third, Phil Seaton in fourth, Dave Smith in fifth, and Paul Garner on a 47 bike in sixth place. 